Hello and welcome back to another Understand Your Buyer video. In this video, we're looking at the notion of by the time you read this. So what is it? Well, if you really want to connect with your buyer, then this is a neat experiential tactic that gets them to imagine and connect with things happening in real time. And you've probably seen this before. By the time you've read this, this many homeless people will have become homeless and this many animals would have died or this many flights will have taken off and landed and crashed or whatever. It's taking your experience of time as it passes in the here and now and relating that to the focus of the advertisement, the focus of the thing that we're trying to sell to the person. So how does it work? Well, it works because it makes it real. You imagine that something is hap literally happening right now, and of course, it probably isn't happening right now. It's just an amalgamation, a calculation of the average number of things. But you imagine something's happening right now, and the impact it's going to have on you. So in this suspiciously low-resolution example, it's talking about animals that are being trafficked and slaughtered for human con consumption and I don't just think about the time it takes me to read this so 322,860 animals will have died for human consumption in the time it's taking you to read this I don't just think about that I think about what's going on before and after and how much bigger that number gets so if in the few seconds it took me to read that's 300,000 well in the next hour that's going to be the absolute millions is it not and this is the point. This is a far more compelling way than just saying, every day this many animals die for human consumption. If you make it more real and connectable by the time you read this, this will have happened. That's when it can hit home for a lot of people. So how can you use it? Well, to make this work, we need two distinct elements. The first is something that happens often or in a high volume that's significant. So the animals being slaughtered, for example, 322,000. If that was one animal died by the time you've read this or two, it's still a shame, but it's not as compelling. So we need the biggest number possible. And then second, mechanically, you need to calculate how long it takes somebody to read the sentence and then do the maths and work out what the number happens to be. So that's by the time you read this. By the time you've read this, XXX will have happened. It's a great way to make your buyer see the urgency of the situation they are facing. Well, that's it for another Understand Your Buyer video. And if you like this kind of stuff, then you'll definitely like the book, which you can buy at understandyourbuyer.com.